Hi everybody, how you doing? It's you, it's me, I'm Grant, and you're my team. I have not had a chance to play Animal Crossing all day today because I have been trying to get Sunday's video rendered and I'm not kidding, it took about four hours just to render what you're gonna see on, well, Sunday. So, already off the bat, we have Marcel walking around and he is our French mime dog. We love him, he's so cute. I just wanna give him the good pets. But look at this, new update. We have a town hall. Hello everyone, this is Tom Luke. It's 6 or 2 p.m. this happy Friday, March 27, 2020. Now then, I'm sure you can all guess what I'm going to tell you next. It's Tadia's big announcement, man. I stated in a previous broadcast. Tadia with complete construction on the resident services building. That's not all the big news for Tadia. We've also added someone to our island staff. Girl, get in here. Come on over! Ah! Hello, I'm Isabel. As Mr. Nook said, I'm part of the resident services staff here on Legacia. While I still have much to learn, I will do my best to support everyone who calls this island home. Isabel has previously done resident support work. So I'm sure she'll be a big help to everyone here, huh? I've got more to share! The building isn't the only new thing around here! We gave the plaza some much needed improvements as well! Normally the plaza's for residents and visiting peddlers who take advantage of its prime location, but keep an eye out for occasional seasonal events too. Should be such fun for everyone, yes, yes! Well, I believe that wraps up all the announcements for today, man, except for one final team. This was my very last bra- No! Oh, wait, does she take it over? Starting tomorrow, Isa- Yay! Isabel will be a source for island news. I'll do my best to share all the updates with you, so I hope you'll tune in often. Yes, yes, there you have it. New building, new island, staff, we're growing, growing, growing! New island staff, boom, but a clat! I feel like that's offensive for me to say, so I'm gonna redact that. Finding out what's new at resident services is easy as stopping by and inquiring, hmm? Of course, we plan on holding a ceremony to commemorate a new resident services building. We'd love for everyone to take part. I believe that sums it all up. Isabel and I will be there to help you whenever you need us. Guys, thank you for bearing with me. And let's do this! Okay, I have a list of the stuff that I need to get through in this. Because I'm trying to get this, like, concise, you know? I'm trying to make this, like, a concise sort of episode today. Like, about 30 minutes. We've already been going for, like, nearly five. Yikes. Um, town flag, town chew, mortgage, town tour, current bell tree, next bell tree, four fossils, talk to residents, museum update, check the shop. Design a black hoodie because I've been designing my own wardrobe because oh my god we got Sahara! Hey girl! Oh yeah, I, I kind of went in on Animal Crossing over these last eight days. Hi, how are you? And um I have a lot of money. I'm rich and look around look around us. We're not living in a tent anymore. We're living with a garden and a house. But for now, hello, you are calling me Sahara. For it is the name I have carried for as long as I have carried these rugs. I bring these rugs from my home, which is far, to help you decorate your home, which is near. I have small rugs, large rugs, and rugs of the medium size between. The design is seen after the buying. I also have mysterious flooring and wallpaper. Oh, how surprising you will find it. Are you ready to buy? Uh, honestly? I really like the idea of a rug. Please and thank you. Yes, a rug for your purchasing. What size will be this rug of yours? Small rug is 1,000 bears. Medium rug is 1,500 bears. Large rug, 2,000 bears, yes? Um, honestly, sister girl, I'm gonna need a medium. 
thank you. Ah, oh, my favorite size. Now please, I will accept the money payment. I love Sahara. She's one of my absolute favorites. Ms. Designer Camel Toe over here. I love her. When customer smiles, my heart and purse grow one size bigger. I have exchange tickets as bonus for good soul who buys good drugs. If you save up five tickets, you can trade for mysterious wallpaper or mysterious flooring. You bought the medium rug, so that means two tickets are yours now. Aw, thanks, sister. I hope you will buy again. May the tickets tempt you. You know what? I really like that. What's this rug? Colourful vinyl sheet. Ooh, girl. Ooh, we have a, a, a thing in here. Nook Inc. Update from Resident Services. To celebrate the opening of the new Resident Services building, we have lots of new Miles Redemption items available. Woohoo! Yes! Okay. Plus, we now have a new service for Nook Miles Plus members to earn five times more miles. I love this already. This, this is everything. This is what I've wanted. Okay. Oh my god, this music! just taking in this music I'm so sorry that we've been quiet it's just because we've been listening to acoustic guitar and it's the same loop over the last 10 well eight days 10's an exaggeration actually it has been eight I'm one of those purists that's not bothered time traveling so my town kind of looks well barren but it's what you can see it's quite humble I like it so this is what we've done with the garden we've made a garden first of all with all of this and that was a money tree. That was yesterday's money tree. Um, it grew. I planted 30,000 bells and it came out with 30,000 bells on each little place where you would normally have fruit. So I ended up with 90 grand overall. I know, I'm amazed too. This is another money tree. This is another money tree. This one will be done tomorrow. Oh, look at that, a money tree spot. You know what we're gonna have to do? Make an investment. Uh, can I swap that? Thank you. Right, okay, so, 10, 10, 10, hold, dig it up, mwah, flavor, it's beautiful, a thousand bells, gimme. Right, drag that, drag that, put that away, and bury that. Boom! I mean, instead of just doing that, I could just press up on my D-pad. I didn't really fancy, I forgot about it. I'm sorry, okay? I'm dumb. But we've got lovely red and yellow roses here, and this is cute. We like this. This is fine. Okay, right. We'll do a quick tour of our town. Oh, it looks so nice. Ugh, we are changing that flag up, though. So... I'm gonna talk you through, in fact, we'll do that after, we'll come back here afterward and I'll talk you through what I've done over the last few days. So, we got a sign, it's cute. And we put it as like a welcoming thing for the guests. It's really cute, just in case we ever have guests. And believe me, I do get guests. Right, okay, so I'm gonna pick that up. We crossbred flowers as well. I got some pink roses, I got some black roses. They're cute, this is the museum. This got set up on day three. It was beautiful, Bill, my good boy. Oh my god, a town tune. 
That's the first time I've heard the town tune. <laughs> Yo, you been training, Quacko? Let's talk. I like to do Lake Hilldown before I start my evening routines up. Can't beat it, Quacko. Ah, uh, Bill's actually really grown on me over this last like thingy, over this last week. To say he's one of our starters. <gasps> Girl! Oh my god, my cousin is wigging right now. My cousin is gonna be wigging because she's got Renee in her town. Clover, if you're watching this, girl, thank you. Dear, I don't know who. So I was strolling along the beach, listening to the waves roll in, and suddenly I had this rad DIY idea. I figured somebody out there would want to try building it. And with that, good luck. Got the DIY recipe. Let's sell them. Thanks, Renee. Oh, that's a DIY recipe for a shell lamp. By the way, do you like this hoodie? I've designed it. I designed this one myself because it's actually based on the one that I'm wearing right now. Yes. And like, I, I made sure to nail all, all the detail. That's another money tree surrounded by white roses. I could talk you through who's moved into our town. Bill, this is his house. He's now no longer living in a tent. He now has a garden of hyacinths and oh, <laughs> We've crossbred some pink hyacinths. This is nice. Okay, brilliant. He has a little exercise ball as well because he is our jock. Right. Um, we have a lot of orange trees as well. They've grown. We have some peach trees because I've been playing with a couple of other people and they have been gracious enough to grab me peaches. We have a shop. I know, this is cool. Tommy and Timmy finally moved out. It's insane, we have coconuts all along our beach. Like, they're slowly growing. It's great. Like, a lot's changed. A lot is still very similar, but a lot has changed, and it feels really good. Hey, Simon. Nice. Well, I hope you're enjoying Valkyria Chronicles 4. <gasps> Big fish. I have found out the hard way that in this game, I suck at fishing. So, excuse me. Never mind, sea bass. Isabel, I want sea bass illegal. Ugh. Although, can I just pick your brains for a moment? It's 6 p.m., right? This is the most beautiful hour of the day. I do not care. It is the single most gorgeous hour of the day, in my opinion. When you look at the sky. <sighs> That's glorious. Right, okay. Let's see if we can find Marcel. I'm gonna show you guys Marcel. He was in the intro, but like way, way in the beginning. But I really wanna see, we know he's out. Is he running around? Nope, let's try up here. Oh, we have a ladder. We have a ladder, we have a vaulting pole. We can get across, that's why we're so like, you know, able to explore. We're awesome, right. Fish, goodbye. anything over here for us not up on the highest cliff but that is where i'm gonna put the able sisters shop when they decide to settle hello yay nice this is the house of miss norma wilcox yes i gave norma a last name her name is wilcox like bill has D for his last name. Oh, she's working on a recipe, girl. Talk to me. It's nice of you to stop by, but I'm kind of preoccupied just now. What are you making? I'm currently crafting a terrarium just to see how I do it. DIY is a great way to learn by doing. I'm totally obsessed by it. Grant, wanna learn how to make your own terrarium? Sure. All righty. I wrote down all the details right here. It should be easy for you. Thank you. Hey, that's my sister girl. How you doing, Clover? Give it a try when you have time and materials. I have no idea what a terrarium is. I'm just gonna say that now. I probably have seen one, but I have not. <gasps> we even have a time to when we leave. Oh, I love that so much. Girl, this game's just so flipping charming. 
and I love it. Oh yeah, we have these as well, little wooden park benches. Cause I crafted, I've been busy with this game. I put in time on the grind, and it's so for you today. I don't know, I can't. We know, we've assessed this that I can't sing, but I still do it anyways. Not because I shouldn't, but because I like to. And yee! Okay, we're over. And this is our house again. We should go on a quick tour of our house in the middle of the street. There's no streets, but whatever. So, I would knock, but it's my house, you know. <laughs> we'll find Marcel in a bit anyways. Right, so here's the main room. We are, well, this is kind of sort of like a semi-crafts room. It's bad and bougie and, well, honestly, I kind of like it. It's a bit of a disaster. But this one is our insanely colorful room at the back. <gasps> Yay, it's so cute. I love it. Okay, hold on. I'm going to have to dress for this one. Wait, let me whip out my Nook phone. Custom designs. Take a look at this. Wear tops. Ah, this is the first design I made. These eyebrows, they're not even mine. They're not even real. They are face paint. This was the first design. This was before I have pro designs. So, let me just dip back into my phone real quick. Here's a pink hoodie I made because I have a pink hoodie IRL. I know, it's actually really, really cute and I love it so much and it's so sweet. I love it, it's so cute. Look at me, I'm so sweet. You just wanna put me in your pocket. Oh, I'm so cute. Right, next. Uh, this one is not based on anything, but this is just a nice cute little sweater that I made because you know, why the heck not? So it's just light blue, stars, and pink. Hems, is it hemline? Anyways, the edges, it's cute. You would think that being someone who's worked in fashion before that I wouldn't know, but nope. It was never my strong suit. This is a salmon colored shirt based on one that I actually have. Yes, I have a salmon shirt. Deal with it. Let me improve this lighting. There we go. Much nicer. Right, uh, we're nearly done, I promise. Oh, this one's not really based on anything. But this is so sweet! I love this a lot! This is, a, this is again, salmon, but I went with the chocolate sort of uh, polka dot feel for it. Because why not? You know? Hey! It's cute! Ecstasy à toile. Uh, that hoodie that I was wearing. The Tokyo Jumper! Girl! I call this one the Tokyo Jumper because this is literally in my wardrobe. I have this. This is in my wardrobe. Okay? So you see the little black dots? Well, that is where the word Tokyo is written. Well on the real jump, on the real world jumper. And then we have like a little pink and white stripes on the sleeves, on each sleeve, and they're so cute, and I love it. Yes, it's great. Okay, uh, this one is not really based on anything either, but this is ecstasy étoile, étoile being the French word for stars. It's beautiful, uh, not really a fan. So I'm gonna go back to this one, which I lovingly, lovingly crafted. So much of my time went on this one. It is my favorite, it's what I'm wearing now. This is what's happening, deal. Girl, you better get that music playing. Mmm. Damn. And this is our last room. This is our green. Excuse me. This is our green room. Yay. Oh, it's beautiful. Green is my favorite color, and that has been cooking all damn day. Thank you. <laughs> oh, it's ready. Okay. Right. Uh, we have chat logs. We have Critipedia, Rescue Service. We have Nook Miles. We have all of this. DIY recipes, let's just check this. Light bamboo rug, shell lamp. I would have thought that a terrarium would have shown up here somewhere, but I guess not. Uh, okay, none of these look familiar. Oh, what's that? Oh, shell speak, girl! Okay, right, anyways. So we have to take a quick trip to the bulletin board at the town because that's what I want to do. And it's my town. Right. Okay, it's okay. I'm just deleting the things that we've already done on my phone. Going down this list. We've covered a lot already, so that's good. Right, okay, so. Let me talk you through these last eight days. Day eight is today. So, when you start up Animal Crossing New Horizons, there's... 
a Nook Miles achievement for posting on the bulletin board. So I did day one, doing it for the miles. And then I thought, let's actually make posts catalog every day so I can recap you guys on what this has been like for me. So welcome to day two. We have a museum tent and a shop being constructed. Norma, Marcel and Gabby have agreed to live here. Things are gonna get quite lively on the island. We've yet to talk to Mira as well as Gabby and Marcel, but I'm sure they're doing okay without me. Okay. Yes, my good friend, Star Witch, yes. At Guy Who Paints. There you go, that's your shout out. Go follow this one on Twitter, thank you. Okay, day three, the museum's actually under construction because I finally donated the 15 things necessary because, you know, Blathers be needing that for his life. Bugger. Betsy the Tarantula looked at me weird last night. I needed to donate her ASAP because that wasn't normal. Day three, still, but this time it's with Chloe, my cousin Clover. Thank you so much, girl. Love you, Tom. I would send daily postcards. She has not lived up to that. Lots of love. Thanks, sis. I love you too. You're so sweet. Okay, day three, still. Got the ladder, got roses, got more peaches from Cloverfield, thanks sis. Went to Fodlan for a bit to weed out a problem. No girl, her island was nasty, but that was because she didn't have a ladder. So I got up in the cliffs and I de-weeded like pretty much all of her island. Not on day three, but like I helped. Anyways, houses are sorted and fences. Yes, we got fences on day three and we got the houses placed on day three. It was great. Okay, also day three, we have a shop. We, they have a great selection. They have carpets, they have wallpaper, they even sell plant life. It was great. Okay, day four. Gabby was the only new resident to move in and settle in Legacia. The museum is finished. It's glorious. The bridge is finished and it's opening the way up to the shop. Day five. Norma moved in today. Marcel must be due tomorrow. I have a room on the back of my house now because I paid off my mortgage on day four, so Nook expanded it for day five. So, it's been a bit of a slow day. Hopefully tomorrow's better. Day six. Pink roses came from crossbreeding. It only took six days for me to finally get lucky with the crossbreeding. Woohoo! Marcel's moved in. Resident services will be closing tomorrow, that's day seven, for expansion. Happy times. Okay, again with the day six. Mortgage number three is paid off. So that means I have, at this point, I believe, yeah, just the front and the main house, the main room. And I was getting the side room, the green room that we had on day seven. So, mortgage three paid off. I can enjoy being a homeowner for a solid 24 hours before I have to scrounge half a million from nowhere. Also made a hoodie. That's the one you're wearing. The one I'm wearing. Day seven. Bitch! I have a flag ready for us. The first money tree bloomed with 90k. I grew my first set of black roses. Mabel Abel appeared. New room on the house. That's the green room. Town hall tomorrow. That's today. Girl, that has been my week. Okay, let's have a chat. We have to go inside. Boom. I'm home, bitches. Come on. Let's have a look. Oh, look at them! Oh, Grant, hello! Hello! Welcome to the new and improved resident services team! Oh, did I say they are, of course, meant building, and we couldn't have built it without your help. Now, as I mentioned in my broadcast, we need new island support staff for the building, so Isabel's here to take good care of us. You're Grant, right? Mr. Nooks told me about you. I just started today, so I'm sure I have my hands full learning all the ins and outs of the new job. But I'm already smitten with island life, so you can count on me doing my absolute best. And here you have it. Isabel and I will split up duties here to better support ya. Bradley speaking, I take care of anything related to homes or other construction issues. Isabel will help you with general island matters and resident support. Sit at the appropriate counter when you need the help and we'll rush over in two swishes of a raccoon's tail. She is a shih tzu. Thank you. In fact, have a seat now so we can discuss your new services. And without out of the way, I have something I'd like your help with. When you have a moment, sit down at my counter. I hope I can count on your continued support to Legacia and our new resident services built in. Um, that's great and all, but first, I need to check recycling. 
Thank you. Oh, cup, really? Girl, I need some better than cardboard boxes. So, if anyone's familiar with our Bayonetta Let's Play, our Bayonetta 2 Let's Play, okay? Um, I, when I was editing that for the very, very first time before it got re-uploaded to this version of the channel, basically what happened was, when I was editing, I think it was episode 9, it may be 9, I'm not too sure, um, I found the best thumbnail that would make for the best reaction image for if anyone ever stepped out of line or displayed toxic behaviour or something that you could be shocked at. I'm gonna put this up on screen now. And <laughs> okay, I thought, you know what? For our town flag, we've got to have that. Isabel. Oh, Red, you're here already. Here you are already. At this counter, I can help you with both general issues and issues you may face with other residents. We can delve into the details when specific concerns arise. No need to worry about that now. But since you're here, I may as well ask, do you have any specific concerns at the moment? Indeed I do. Oh, this is so exciting! My first official request! <clears throat> I'm sorry. That wasn't professional, was it? Now then, how can I help you today? I would like to change the island flag. You want to change the flag of resident services? And that one at the airport too? Fantastic! Our flag is the physical embodiment of everything Legacia represents to folks on the island. Oh no, I'm about to make this horrible. <laughs> oh no! It's proudly displayed in front of resident services and outside the airport. I'll admit the design is a little... Dated? Do you happen to have something else in mind? I do, disgusted Bayonetta. <gasps> oh my god! <gasps> it's perfect in every way. It truly captures the essence of Legacia. From this point forward, your design will be our new flag. Thank you so much for your submission. Can I help you with anything else? Yes, please change the island tune. I'm certain you've heard the current Legacia island tune. You really can't miss it. It plays in multiple locations across the island, and it reminds us residents of the time. I think the current anthem's a classic, but there's always room for change and improvement, so you don't have to be a musician to compose a tune. So, if you have any ideas for a new one, let me know! Uh, yes, so, my ideal is C. Nope. It's C. G. E. G, C, G, E, G, B, G, F, G, yep, E, G, nope, G, C, B, C, hold that note, C, and yes! Our national anthem, bitches! Okay, well, I do have a little musical knowledge. Allow me to preview the tune you've created. If any of you fuckers make her sing Megalovania, I will hunt you down and bully you. How inspiring! Your new island tune makes me so proud to call Legacia my home. Now then, we'll start using it right away. I hope you enjoy hearing it when you're out and about. I will. Can I help you with anything else? I'm good. You've taken care of everything I needed to. By the way, yes, that is a hyacinth in my hair. Girl, did I get me I did. Surely, for changing the flag and for doing the other stuff. Girl, come on. Legacia icons. At Resident Services, we want new ideas for the island flag and island tune. We have Nook Miles in store for those creative types who can redesign and rewrite. It's good to take pride in our symbols. Boom. Flag waver. Boom. Humming musician. Boom. Nailed it. Anything else? Nope. Cool. Awesome sauce. 
Let me put these bells in my account because my lord, a, 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 a notice from the Nook Mileage Program. We're sorry that the Nook stock was unavailable all day yesterday due to construction on resident services. To make up for that, we're giving any customers who access the Nook stock today 500 miles. Thank you. Also, regardless of your access history, your daily access bonus will be set as seven plus days tomorrow, which is brilliant because I've not missed a single day. Thank you. We'll hope you continue to use the Nook Stop and the Nook Mileage program in the future. Please select from the following services. Girl, I need to go ABD, and I need to deposit all of it. Thank you. I feel good for that. Thank you for using our service. Sign off. Well, hello dear Grant! Just like that, your home has another proper room, hmm? That's another upgrade to even cushier lifestyle, which brings us to... The cost of your immortal, that would be 548,000 bells, huh? Ah, oh, yes, please make your payments using the Nuke Stops EBD feature one shoved them, I shoved them before. Oh, another thing I shared me and Sean. Now that you made some big improvements to your home, I can start offering customization services. This is not about increasing the size of your home. It's about changing the look of your home's exterior. Now we can offer... What we can offer does depend on the size of your home, but shall pay for customization up front, so you can prioritize customization over home expansion and vice versa. As Alice, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. Uh, sir, I need you to actually. Yes, yes, this is the construction consultation counter. Before we begin, allow me to quickly explain the services offered at my counter. In addition to my normal duties, I can also talk about issues related to island construction. There are lots of fun little projects that will make the island more comfortable place to live. I can help you with building bridges or inclined, such as. Yes! Be yes, thank you. Or even moving existing buildings! These are optional extras for your island experience, so these services will of course incur additional fees. And with that information in mind, what you think? How can I be of service to you? I need you because you wanted my help. Oh, you already here got to hear out how you can help, huh? Well, we got a fine building for resident services now, and you no doubt admire the plaza, huh? It's primed and ready for me at events, and if I have anything to see about it, to think we start with a deserted island and have grown into a bustling community. Yes, you have me to single-handedly thank. My spine is broken from carrying you bitches and hoes. You're welcome. I want to do something grand to celebrate. Oh, yes. How big plans. Ah, uh, Good luck with that. Tell me more. Oh, oh, oh got your attention, huh? Our goal is to have the incredibly popular musician Kia Kia Slider come and put on a show here in the gas, yeah. Grant, I'm sure you know who Kia Kia is. I'm his biggest fan. Mwah! I always knew you had the excellent taste, Grant. By the way, his song Kia Kia Lament is my go-to karaoke song. Ah, sorry about that. As you might have guessed, I'm a big fan. It's easy to get sidetracked talking about him. Back to goal. If we hold a Kia Kia concert here, Legacia could become a household near. We've done a lot so far to further develop the island, but a Kia Kia should be the culmination of all our hard work. I'd love your cooperation, Grant. When you're ready for more details, come ask me. What should I do again? Right, okay, so you want to do that, but I want a bridge, because we've only got one. And girl, it's not happy. I'm not happy with it. Right, uh... Oh, no, we need a ceremony. We need a ceremony, and then we can do the thing. You want to take part in the ceremony, right? Right now, we're looking at holding the ceremony for the resident services building. Interested? I sure am. Splendid! Let's get started. Thank you. I'm gonna get real comfy for this one real quick. Thank you. <clears throat> Everybody's here! Now then! Welcome to the dedication ceremony honoring Legacia's brand new resident services. Click! Thank you! Thanks to everyone's tireless efforts, Legacia is developing wonderfully, yes? I must confess, I thought a little resident services building might be a tent forever, but now, 
Here we are with a beautiful new facility the whole island can enjoy. Once again, I must ask everyone who supports our elephants, and I would be at fault if I feel to acknowledge this strong ally who will help me run things from now on. Isabel, if you can grace our islands with a few words. I'm so glad for this opportunity to say thanks to Legacia. Like Mr. Nook said, I'm Isabel. I haven't been on this island long, so I have a ways to go until I'm fully up to speed, but you can bet your bottom bell that I'll help in any way I can. That's why she is a bell. If you need anything, come see me. Clap for the bitch, clap for the bitch, clap, clap for the bitch, clap for the bitch, clap. Thank you, thank you, Isabel. Next, we get a few words from someone who made a resident services building possible. That's right, this year from our resident rep. Great! Look at the flag! <laughs> ah, I love it. Anything to add? We are amazing! Clap for me, clap for me, clap! Yes, yes indeed, thank you for your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there, Grant. Everyone, please get ready to join me in beginning this ceremony to a close. Bringing this ceremony to a close, what so those wishing to get a commemorative motto should be ready with that. The cord catch our time. Yes, well then, we hope for our continued growth and celebrate Legacia's beautiful resident services. Hooray! Everybody express the joy and clap and sing! Thank you all! This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. I'm having that, I don't care, that's a memory, that's a moment, that's history, that's part of our legacy on Legacia. So, there's one last thing that I want to do before we wrap things up today. Thank you, how you doing? And it's actually quite simple. Look at them, they're so cute, stop it! Hi! Oh, Grant, hello, hello! This is the Construction Consultation Council, how can I help you, huh? Uh, let's talk infrastructure, thank you. Let's chat! I don't like how the money came up. There are a number of things we can discuss, but what did you have in mind? Uh, I would like to talk about bridges. Oh, oh, curious about bridges and inclines here? Excellent! Because with the renovation of resident services, we have something new for getaway package participants. This new service makes it easy and fun to add major projects such as bridges and inclines to the island. Major projects don't come cheaply though, no no. However, everyone who lives on the island can freely contribute toward the construction fees. We can discuss your island hopes and dreams even if you don't have quite got the funds to get it yet, man. Be advised, you can only have either a bridge or an incline under construction at a given time, so it's one or the other, that's fine. So consider your plans carefully before discussing them with me, hmm? Now, what would you like to discuss? I would like to discuss a bridge, thank you sir, thank you. Okay, you'd like a new bridge, huh? Ah uh, yes, bridges are a good way to connect islands separate from rivers, we know. Go ahead and pick from our catalogue. Right, we have log bridge, we've already got one of those and I don't like it. Suspension bridge, I don't like it. Stone bridge, I like it. Wooden bridge, eh, it's a bit basic. Brick bridge, yes! Iron bridge, ooh! Red zen, ooh! Zen, uh. Brick, that's our bridge, I don't care. A brick bridge! And just sure about this, I want to proceed with the bridge. Yes, please. Excellent, man. In that case, let's sit on a location next. Use the bridge marker kit I placed within your pockets to set aside some land for a bridge project. You touched me without my consent. Excuse me, sir? Use your kit near a river and shall be able to imagine how a bridge will look. Oh, my lord. We gotta get out and build a bridge. Oh, yeah. We gotta do this first, and then we gotta go and... Oh, my god, that flag is a masterpiece. That flag is an absolute masterpiece. You know what? <laughs> Bitch, I did myself on my shit. Girl, I pull up, but don't kill my flowers. Thank you. Oh, weed. I got to kill the weed. And I honestly, I don't care if... Gabby, Gabby! Okay, so bridge marker kit, and I would like to build this here. Uh, no, I need to rethink that because I want the middle of the bridge to be right in 
here, like right up so that you can get straight up to Gabby Gabby's front door. Uh, no, I need to rethink that. Gabby Gabby, hey girl. Right, hold on. This is gonna be like, cause this is the thing, I'm a bit precise. I'm trying to just look at this now and I'm thinking, let me imagine, let me imagine it, let me imagine, let me see. Visualize, visualize. Oh, wait, hold on. If I go right, one more then, to the left, to the left, everything you own in a box to the left, in the closet, that's my style, saying like, bitch, I'm the diamond in the rough. What, what? They're not the lyrics, but, oh God, I think I went too far. Right, okay, I need to rethink. I'm determined to get this. Right. Try this. And if I can't have it, wait, I think that's still the same. It is, but I still want to imagine it. Right, okay. So I think it's just two, I think it's two tiles across. Which means, girl, I may have to destroy a bit of your friends. It's going to happen. It's going to happen, period, period. Yep, I'm destroying a fence. This'll do, this'll do, this is perfect, this is fine. Let the land connect. Oh, girl, my phone. I gotta answer this real quick, hold on. Hello, Grant. Did you find a good spot for the brick bridge? I found a great spot. Wonderful. Now as part of the kitchen setup, Lloyd the Gyroid will start and stay and collect the donations for the construction fees. Island residents can contribute a little by little. Once we reach our goal, construction will begin. Of course, you can feel free to make whatever hefty donations you want, Grant. And if you don't make any hefty donations, our goal might never become a reality. So basically, it's down to me once again to carry these holes on my camel toe because I'm strong. I've got bucket deep energy and we're ready. Anywho, all construction donations shall go to Lloyd. And we'll talk again soon, hmm? Yeah, we better. So, let's just talk to Gabby Gabby real quick because I have not talked to her yet and I have the perfect voice for her. It's a Hilda Valentine gonorrhea. How are you doing, honey bun? Let's chat. <gasps> Did you know the moon is about 235,000 miles away? I'm gonna walk around Legacia shore until I've walked that far. Just call me Moon Rabbit. Um, maybe, but maybe not. Oh girl. Gotta check my phone, we blowing up, we popping off. Hey, thank you for the miles, this is cute. Right, and then the very last thing that I wanna do in today's episode before I wrap things up here for us is, wait, what time are we on? 44, nice, okay, cool. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Not you. I want an emperor butterfly, they go for four grand, get over here. I said get over here. Bitch! Thank you. Asshole. It's not your average mark. But we have to go talk to my girl. You know, best girl. Gabby is like top two best girls on this island. Like, Norma cannot compete, I'm sorry. But come on. Our OG. Yo, Cottontail. Thanks for stopping by. I wanna chat. I feel like I'm always staying up way too late. B bitch, that's a mood, duh. Like, I say I'm gonna go to bed early, but then I end up reading a book or something. And then I gotta know what happens next, so I keep turning pages. That was me with Hunger Games. Legit, for real, that was me with Hunger Games. Mockingjay, mwah, best one. And pretty soon, I'm near the end, so I figure I may as well finish. And suddenly the sun's up. Bitch, no wonder you stay in bed until like nine o'clock. By the way, I love what you did with your furniture. It's gorgeous. Just like you, Mwah, the flavor. Thank you. Shop. Oh, look at that inky sky. This is beautiful. This has turned into a very productive day. So far, and I've yet to, ca I've, I've got to catch up on all of this. I've got to catch up on, <gasps> Marcel! No. Bitch, we have to talk to Marcel. I don't care. Tommy and Timmy, let me out. Ooh. Oh my God. Hi, big balls. Hello, let's play. Exercise ball. 1,100, girl! Look at you two selling balls. We will check out the floor and the walls that they have on sale in a bit, but I need to talk to Marcel because he's my French baby. And I think he's the only one that we've not talked to now today. Marcel, 
<gasps> my baby! Is a walking buddy? What's the latest? I was thinking about what to do and I almost had an idea! Almost. Oh, baby, one more. What's going on? Huh? You should design that. Team Varta T hoodie? Neat! You should look really cool walking around in your own designs saying, Look what I did, world! Oh, one more. Huh? What's going on? What's the latest? I'm yelling, it's me! I'm the one yelling! There's no buildings around here, no? I can practice yelling as loud as I want to! I really like Marcel. I really like him. Look at all my peaches. We've already been there, but now we get to look at that, and then I get to just take this back. Oh yeah, I want to do... Do you guys want to see what I got in my museum? We're gonna do this. We're gonna do what the... We're gonna do the quick museum. Okay. So, let's have a quick look in here. Here's what we got today. Oh, that's cute. Pink umbrella. What flowers have we got? Orange windflower, red rose, red tulip, white windflower, white tulip, white rose, customization kits. <gasps> Girl, green wrapping paper. What we got for recipes? DIY for beginners, flimsy shovel, flimsy axe, wildest dreams, test your DIY. I've got all of these. Flimsy watering can, slingshot, ladder recipe, vaulting pole recipe, because we've already got them, but the vaulting pole never breaks. Oh my god. Inject into my bloodstream. That's gorgeous. Inject into my bloodstream. That's gonna be my basement. That's gonna be my main room. That's gonna be the far right room. And oh, that's nice as well. Girl, we got a lot to spend suddenly. I need to take it out of my bank. The bridge can wait. But hopefully, by the next time you guys join us, then, you know, the bridge will be done. I would really like that. That would be great. Okay, so. Very quickly, man. Right, so we've talked to Mira, we've talked to Norma, we've talked to everybody, I think, at this point. Hey, Tiger Beetle, die. It's gone. It's so nice to finally have a town hall. Bill! When did it get so late? How long have I been out here, Quacko? I want to chat. Grant, the clothes you got me are awesome. <laughs> I couldn't wait to show this off to you. How's it look? Perfect fit to show off my muscles, right, Quacko? Oh, girl. You are not getting away. We have not got one of these. Yes! I caught a peacock butterfly. Now it's my turn to strap my stuff, but I can't carry this much. I'm going to have to drop something. Okay, right. This is fine. I'm going to drop my weed because nobody needs weed in the life. Thank you. The weed is disgusting. Right. Heading inside, we're gonna visit Blathers. That was Sahara in the back on the right. Yes, I saw. Moving around because she is the whore. She's not, she's lovely. Thank you for the town tune. Why, hello, Grant. Welcome to the Legacia Museum. How may I be of service? Make a donation! Marvelous. What would you like to donate? I would like to donate the peacock butterfly because we don't have one in our museum yet, mister. <laughs> a peacock butterfly! Ugh, what a wretched thing! Alas, I am obliged to ask. Would you like to learn more about this specimen? Please, tell me. Oh, I see. In that case... <clears throat> Pretty as a peacock? Bah, I say. The wings of the peacock butterfly may have a pattern similar to that of the beautiful bird, but its forewings are also often covered in a dark, velvety hair. You heard that right? Hairy wings! A hair-raising revelation indeed. Anywho, my sincerest thanks for your donation. And though bugs are the bane of my existence, rest assured the wretched thing will get the best of care here. Is there anything else I can help you with? No, I'm fine. Oh, no, wait. Actually, jolly good. Please take care on the rest of your visit. Yes, there is something. I would like you to assess these fossils tray quickly. Thank you. One, two, thank you. Ooh, more than one, I see. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Ooh, hey, I found something that's not yet part of our esteemed collection. It is magnificent indeed. You have a talent for finding the finest of fossils. Now I do hope you'll consider donating what you found. The cultural development of Legacia is a worthy endeavor indeed. In the meantime, I shall return these to you, but think on what I've said. The museum awaits. Now then, 
Is there anything else I can help you with? Make a donation! What would you like to donate? Oh my god. So it's a T-Rex skull. We've already got one of those. <gasps> Archaeopteryx? Be it. Come on. Give me. Ooh! <laughs> Could it be? It is. An Archaeopteryx. I never thought I'd lay eyes upon such a well-preserved Archaeopteryx. Dear me, might I give you a short presentation on the topic? I am quite knowledgeable, you know. Please! Wonderful, tis fascinating stuff, I assure you. Now, where to begin? Archaeopteryx's feathers led many people to believe that it was the progenitor of the birds, eh what? But sadly, further evidence indicated likely not a direct ancestor, more an evolutionary uncle, if you will. Every time a specimen is found, new theories pop up, and new relatives come to roost in the family tree. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Rest assured, all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. Is there anything else I can help you with? No, we're good. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. <laughs> nice, we'll check his miles in a second because this is just too fun. Yay. Okay. Welcome. Oh, I've never been in here at night. This is different. This is a very different atmosphere. I don't want to be in here. Uh, this one. Thank you. Not that one. Flick. Wow. Oh, wow. We've donated 30 fossils. Nice. Based on the number of fossils. Oh, not donated. Dig up. Okay. Dig as many as you can and find out what they are. And then we have to dig up 100 to get our next set of miles there. Sweet. Okay. Let's have a quick run round. Bagworm, wasp, ugly things, very ugly. Yes, spooders. No, we don't like this spooder. This spooder is ugly creature. It's disgusting, man. Right. Emperor butterfly. Tiny little moth looking things. Tiger butterfly gone to sleep. Uh, I think that's the citrus long beetle. Citrus long arm beetle. Yep, nice. And then if we just look down here, we have this up here. More moths and stuff. Turn around. Run into the butterfly house where there should be. Oh, look at you! What are you? What What are you doing in there? Okay, fine. Just chilling. Nice fish. You do you. This is fine. This is cute. We got this. This is good. Right. Oh, emperor butterfly. The music. The music for the museum is just gorgeous. When they bring in them little strings, there. Violin. I love it. It's crazy. It's crazy. Okay. Uh, we got a shitty tin can. We got some bitches. Oh, centipede. You're nasty as fuck. Pillberg. A centipede. Are they fucking? Y'all are not. We got an orchid mantis. Hey. We got nothing. We got... Yeah, fuck off. Oh. We've caught several of those in this week. I'm not even kidding. But then again, I've probably not got as many of, t of, of the tarantulas. Ugh, tarantula. Disgusting. Je detest the tarantula. Warfroach. As what some other people have, because I've seen people who've gone to the island tours and they've just been like, and horde. And I'm just like, why? And someone even put it on Twitter that they were like, Oh, well, you guys are all like Animal Crossing fans and you're all going around catching all these insects and everything. So, you know what? Here's the thing for you. And I'm just like, really? Really? You're going to stick on a photo of a real ass tarantula? You are disgusting. Oh, hey, thanks, bees. Check the time real quick. And we are on 55. If I can take you guys around here in five minutes, design a black hoodie and then listen to the town bell, that will be brilliant. And we'll call it an episode there. Thank you. Okay, so... Having a look down here in the fossils. You know what I love about this place is that with the fossils, one could argue this circular point that I'm stood on, which, by the way, hey, is the center point of the birth of creation. What I mean is there was the Big Bang and then the earliest signs of life were singular cell bacteria that then evolved and grew and formed and changed and evolved. And I said evolved twice because it takes twice as much evolution to make things work as it does anything else in life into every single specimen that you can see before you. So let's take a look over here, shall we? There's the trilobite. Here we have the Milocunmingia. I've probably butchered that and I do not care. Amber, and a fossilized ugly nasty ugly tarantula spooder and I don't like it, get it away from me. I'm gonna keep at least social distancing distance from that thing because that's just disgusting, thank you. Right, next 
Next up, we have dinosaurs and turtles. And they're all so cool. I'm taking this way up because hey, like our collection is meager. At this moment, we've been playing for a week. Our collection is meager. Hey, honey. Right. Heading into the main room of the... I say that this is the main room that we've just been in, actually. The other main room of the things. And we've already completed our saber to tiger because we're just awesomely lucky. Thank you. Whew. Girl. And look at this. I love this. You have all the different animals and variants and species, like... Pierce, Yuka, Kit, Eloise, Chav, Dizzy, probably Antonio. That's absolutely Bob. Don't argue with me. Goldie. I'm going to say Kurt the Bear, Roscoe the Horse, Rhonda the Rhino, Lucy the Pig. Uh, did I say Rocco? Rocco's a Rhino. Uh, I'm going to say Tip of the Cow. Uh, brrr, come on. What's your name? Deirdre, Bunny, uh, Samson, and I'm going to say Chip the Monkey. Yay! Anyways. I don't know if Chip's a monkey name. I feel like it is. I feel like it is. But anyways, we gotta get out. There's two minutes left. Two minutes to run around fish. Yep, go. Five minutes should be plenty. I don't have five minutes. We've got to go. I wanna be outside by the time this bell rings. So we're just gonna run, 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 run. I feel like we're not gonna make it. Wait, what time are we on now? 58? <sighs> we might actually. Right, so we have this set here. It's beautiful, it's cute. It's still meager by comparison. Deep sea stuff. Oh, we're on 59. <gasps> Girl, uh-uh. We're not gonna make this. I caught the anemones. Not the anemones, the uh, sea dude. I caught an oarfish. I know, I'm so cool. I'm not really. What are they called? What are they called? Come on, you put them on pizza. Anchovies, that's it. Is it anchovies? Do you put them on pizza? Oh, uh, garlic pizza, extra anchovy. Ew. My go-to is a pepperoni, actually. I really like pepperoni. It's fun. Literally like baby's first steps up here, down here. You're not missing anything on the top left, don't worry. We need to get out now. It's a very meager collection. Quick, we have to escape. I want to hear the sound of the bell. Thank God the exit's here. We have like 10 seconds. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. And we're out. That was beautiful. Ooh, new music. All right, it's fair to say now, after a week, after having the town hall finally get built, and with it officially being nighttime, with new hourly music, it officially feels like Animal Crossing once again. Now, don't get me wrong, this week has been pretty good, like, overall, for just, like, sinking back into island life, but it now feels as though, with all these first steps that have been put into place, that the legacy is genuinely taking shape. So, with that, I'm gonna have to love you and leave you. <laughs> I know, it's been, it's crazy, we've gone for an hour today, that's bonkers. So, love each other, stay safe, take care of yourselves, and I will see you next time when we have something else to, you know, discuss and show further development of the island. So, take care of yourselves, and goodbye.